these students, as well as the other students here tonight, are here because they have a message that they want to share, a message about wanting healthier communities. We've worked with the students in seven different counties since across North Carolina and asked them the questions. Why is being active important to the next generation? What opportunities are currently available in your community? And how can we work together? It was exciting. I loved it so much. And it was just encouraging seeing all of the films. And it's nice to be able to voice my own opinion and discuss it with adults in a mature manner. I thought it was a good way to get us kids to know about what we need to do and the changes we need to make. It was really cool to be a part of it and it, um, it just made me uh, realize how like big this movement it is and how important it is to our communities. If you have a community garden or a park or a greenway nearby, it's terrific, especially if you have one you can walk to, especially now when a gallon of gas is 375. It's one of those things where we would all love to do that, but it's just not possible for so many of us. There's a lot of different parts I know, and the fact that I can't walk there is just crazy. I was driving to work yesterday, and I saw a girl riding a bike. Her face was red, it was hot and humid. She was driving down the median of a busy road through thick grass, and she looked miserable. I think it's ridiculous. I think not only do people like her deserve sidewalks and crosswalks and easy ways to get places, but I think if these places were built, everyone would get outside, and I think that's what a built environment is really all about. We see a lot of our environment, and so we can give fresh ideas, and um, we have ideas that maybe some adults might not think of, so I think it's, that's really important. How important is that student voice? It's absolutely important, but not only that, it's refreshing and, and a new perspective. It feels kind of great that adults will listen to us and take the time. The fact that we could sit here and actually be able to tell them that we need certain things, or being able to have them listen to us, that's a big difference, and I think that's the whole point. Like, we are making a big difference. It was just marvelous. I am surprised and amazed at the level of sophistication these students had in understanding the issue and being able to creatively demonstrate that. People, we need more exercise equipment. Sitting at home watching TV is not cool. Make a difference. It was amazing to hear what they thought about how we can make our environment more conducive to be physically active. Because like you said, we, we know what we think it, the answer is, but they know what will really motivate them to be more active. It's kind of a new voice that, that adds to the discussion and, and gets that message out. And that's really what's going to change your community, is getting more people involved. Community involvement is key to change. If communities are not involved, we're not successful. So we are very grateful to see places like North Carolina taking this issue and really making it, making it come to life. Yes, pass the word. <laughs> Thank you to the students who are going to help us all have a better world. Good night, everybody. Thanks. <laughs>